Hello, friends. I am jumping on here really quick because I wanted to share a Halloween costume that I put together last minute and it turned out really cute. So I just wanted to share a few of the details with you guys and show it off. Okay, so I just shared this on my Instagram page and it's basically a red dress that I found at my local thrift store for a dollar. And the thing about this dress is it is from Target. It's Cat and Jack and it's a size 10 and 12. And you're probably wondering like, how the heck do I fit into a 10 and 12? Well, I didn't. I had to, took a seam ripper and on the inside here, you can see I ripped apart the seam. Now that gave this exterior fabric here a lot more give so that when I tried it on, I, it fit me. So that's what I did with that. And you can't even tell while I'm wearing it that, that, that I even took that apart. And then later on, if I ever wanted to sew this back up and give it to some other little girl, I could do that or I could keep it and use it as a holiday dress, huh? Now, I added these bows using Dollar Tree black ribbon, and all I did was I took a couple safety pins and just pinned it, pinned them through, and then I did the same thing with a couple bows on the bottom here. I did the same thing to just kind of add a little bit more detail to the dress, and then this dress, because it is a little girl's dress, <laughs> It is short on me because I'm 5'8". So I just took this black tulle skirt that I already had at home and I'm wearing that underneath of it to add a little bit more length to it. Now, the cool thing is, is that I've convinced my son to dress up alongside with me as a cute clown. We just went and got a pair of my husband's red shorts and they're super baggy on my son and he's gonna wear a white t-shirt with his red bow tie and these red suspenders that I found on Amazon. And that is his outfit. And so he's gonna wear some funny socks. Now for my outfit, I did do a clown collar. And so basically I just took a strip of ribbon from Dollar Tree and then I took some tulle from Dollar Tree and I just cut little strips of it and then I tied it to the strip of ribbon. Kind of like if you were making a ragtie garland, you just cut the little strips and then you tie it to the ribbon. And you can do this in any length. Now, because I didn't want those little knots to show at the top, I took a piece of this little pom-pom trim also from Dollar Tree and I used my hot glue gun and glued it right to the top. And then to tie this, you just simply tie it on and then you can have a little bow in the back. And as far as the other accessories, I found this hat at Spirit of Halloween. It was like $6.99 and has a little headband with it and that's how it goes on the head. And just it, so it went with the rest of my costume. Again, I found this red pom-pom trim at Dollar Tree and then I just use a little sewing pin to attach it around the hat so it kind of it goes with everything. I found these black socks from their they're actually thigh high socks but I only have them to the knee high length because I wanted again that red trim to show and so it basically I cut some of that red pom-pom ribbon that is the size of my calf so put the socks on and then just tied it together and then I just when I put my costume on I'm just gonna loop this on so that way I can still use these socks with another costume another year same thing with the hat and then same thing with the dress like everything is just pinned on temporarily so I can just take it apart and use it again later on if we want to maybe I want to use that red dress and use it for another costume I found some of these cute little hair extensions. This came in a pack of two at Five Below and it was like $3, so it was very affordable. And then I found some press-on nails. These are really fun. These are also from Spirit of Halloween and they were $7.99. The makeup, 
I just used black eyeliner for the eyes. I did regular makeup, then I just added the black eyeliner for the clown here, the red nose, and then red lips, and that was it. Okay, that was a super quick video. If you are interested in seeing more Halloween ideas using a red dress, check out simplemadepretty.com. I've got a blog post with more ideas, and then I've also got 30 plus Halloween costumes. You can use a blue dress, and then if you have a black dress, I also have a blog post with 30 plus Halloween costume ideas. There's so many more ideas and all you need are little accessories like the ones I just showed you that you can find at Dollar Tree, Five Below, or other dollar stores. Let me know in the comments if this video was helpful and be sure to subscribe to see more DIY and craft ideas like this. That's all for now, bye.